What's up everybody, this is Antonio here with you, episode 51 of the monthly dividend challenge. You guys already know, we're at the end of the month, or at least we're already at the beginning of the new month. It is time to see how much we actually collected in dividends for the month of February. So definitely stay around uh, because we'll definitely see this dividend snowball much larger as well. We'll end up seeing who guessed it the closest with the guess. Uh, with uh, dividends every single month guys we come back we see how much we grew the dividend snowball well and really we actually see how much we made for the previous month but i do have these scripts that every single sunday i come back we kick these off i continue to dollar cost average into the portfolio we continue to see this grow larger and larger which is very very awesome to see uh, as well here on the annual dividends if we do look here we do have uh, about $784.25 so far for the year uh, this is only including January so uh, this should be a lot higher by the end of the video which will be great uh, and then quarterly dividends is where it's very awesome uh, you'll see the staircase continue to get larger and larger so we'll be wrapping up I guess not wrapping up but we'll be adding month two of Q1 of 2024 and then we will uh, be waiting for the last month for wrapping up this quarter which will be a very very juicy one so uh, we also do have here guys options premium which we've made some pretty good profits in the month of february so far we're at $1,415 this doesn't include this past weeks and then that actually comes out to be about a 2.05 percent percent return on my money invested if we do look here uh, we do have the month of february so this is the second month of the quarter if we do look back at q4 uh, we i guess november is technically the second month of the previous quarter which meet we made 239 dollars and 64 cents uh, let me know what you guys think we'll be making for the month of uh i guess not the month of february i'm actually wanting to know the um how much we're going to be making for the month of march guys we'll come back in april i got those mixed up uh, but anyways yeah let me know how much you guys think we'll be making for the month of march uh, as you'll see that is the third uh third month of the quarter which is december so last december we made one thousand fourteen dollars and 43 cents you guys think we'll be making more less right around the same amount drop your guesses uh, but uh, we will be wrapping it up and then if i do show you just so you guys can kind of know on the dividend payout we do have these companies paying us out for the month of march i believe we also have schd and we have visa that also pay out that month if i do show you here on the holdings just so you guys can get a, get a rough idea we do have all these shares if we do look at the annual payout well i guess if we do look at the projected payout this is what we're projected to be paid out uh yearly and uh you'll see that uh, we do have a lot of snsx so that's one other one that you'll want to account for we do have schd and then there's a visa one and so on so let me know what you guys think we'll be making definitely will be exciting we'll come back in april and see who guessed it the closest for the month of march uh but anyways guys let's go ahead and uh actually first let me show you guys here the options before we do jump over there uh you'll see that so far we're at two thousand four hundred uh seventy one dollars and fourteen cents we're still waiting on one more week for this month but uh very every almost every week for the month of february we made really good profits there and uh i had some more options that did expire worthless there so definitely cannot complain there uh but uh let's go ahead and jump over to the schwab account guys so we can uh, see how much we collected in dividends all right guys so we're here at the schwab account under my history i do have it set to previous month with some filters of just showing up the dividends you'll see this calculator called calculate dividends this is a script i do have i written it uh, i do have a tutorial that i made recently on how to add it if you guys do have a schwab account uh, but all it does is that it adds up all the dividends on the page and shows it to me in a pop-up that way i don't have to pull up a calculator but uh, anyways we'll go to the very bottom uh, you'll see that on the 15th uh, we got the apple dividend which we got four dollars 95 cents very tiny dividend especially because i don't have it not many shares of apple anymore i am selling cash secured put against them to uh, try to accumulate shares again but uh, collect 
premium in the meantime while we do that uh, we do have uh, on the 15th as well we got snsxx which is that u.s treasury money investor that uh, paid me 185 dollars and uh, 83 cents they also paid me out as well uh 203 dollars and nine cents i believe next month they'll combine them together because uh they were showing up as two different positions one on margin and one on non-margin so i believe that got fixed uh, that's the reason why you'll see two different payments there uh, but uh, on the 16th we got the costco dividend of 26 dollars and 40 cents and then if we do look as well you'll see apple got reinvested it dripped its dividend and then costco dripped its dividend which next quarter will get paid even more and you gotta love that dividend snowball guys there and then on the 23rd guys we got a dividend from starbucks which was 30 dollars and uh, 33 cents it also dripped again and uh, we did just get a credit interest just on my money uninvested which we collected a small amount of 53 cents not a huge difference there but uh, this was all the dividends for the month of february pretty easy pretty passive we had to do nothing for this and now this all got reinvested back into the portfolio so that next quarter we get paid even more so gotta love that uh, but anyways let's go ahead and click the calculate dividends and guys we made 400 $50.60. I believe this doesn't include that small 53 cent interest. So just so you guys know. Uh, and then uh, if we do jump back over to the Google Sheets, we can go ahead and put these values and see everything being added over. So $450.60. Uh, you'll see now guys that on the annual dividends, we're at uh, $1,234.85. Uh, we're about halfway of 2020 in the first two months uh, from 2020 this is 12 months guys and in, in two months my portfolio i guess what is it about six years five six years later we are doing that in about two months if we do look at quarterly dividends uh, you'll see that q1 of 2024 1234 dollars and 85 cents we've surpassed what in 2023 q3 what we made in three months we're making that in two months now and uh, as you guys can kind of just see this this is awesome to see i can't wait what 5 10 15 years from now what we'll be producing and then if we do look at the options premium uh, you'll see that uh, February again 1415 that didn't really change and uh, yeah guys this is what actually I made for uh, the month of February let me know in the comment section what you guys think we'll be making for the month of March again for the December which is the third month of the quarter from previous quarter uh, we made $1,014.43 so do you guys think we'll be making more a lot less right around the same amount drop your guesses again here's the dividend payout uh what will be getting paid out uh snsxx visa and sehd are not included on this so you'll want to account for those as well here is the holdings with the number of shares i currently have and um yeah this is actually all i have and uh actually the person that guessed it the closest for the month of february was jim with a guess of 481 dollars and 44 cents very very close off by about 30 ish dollars uh so guys definitely let me know how much you guys think we'll be making for the month of march definitely love seeing you guys comment and letting me know your guesses definitely look forward to that and uh don't forget to subscribe with that notification help me reach that 20,000 subscriber mark definitely would appreciate it as well if you guys wouldn't mind uh, drop a big thumbs up and uh, I will talk to you guys later. Take care. Stay safe out there. Bye guys.